buy a game. So obviously last night we left you off with B Company to IC, Mr. Densmore, telling me what had happened here. So we're in this sort of Zulu muster, waiting for Recky to come back and back brief. Um, so then we can move on forward. They've come back and now delivered that. So what's going to happen now? It's now a quarter to one in the morning. Uh, the fire support, which is uh, Sergeant Edgar, so Gav, and Mr. Kerr, the platoon commander, they're going to take their fire support section and start the move off now. There's probably about 78 kilometres to move, and the ground's, <laughs> the ground's not great, uh, recording to the sort of the recce commander who's come back to get them, so they're going to step off first. We're then in the main body, we're going to go the assaulting team, and we're looking at probably stepping off here from about 02, potentially 03, um, because where we're going to go is on one side of the wadi. They have to cross the wadi without being seen by this sort of enemy objective. That's why they're going to leave first. So they've actually got a four hour foot move, and um, whereas we'll be slightly shorter because we've got that sort of, I haven't got that wadi to, to, to sort of cross. So I'll take you over now and show you uh, Mr. Kerr and Gav, so Sergeant Edgar, their platoon getting ready to go. And then we're, we're going to wait here a bit longer with the main body and deploy it about an hour, an hour and a half after them. So let's go see them. He's on it. Major Gallagher. Gallagher. Ready to rock and roll. What are you going to do? Um, we're going to provide fire support for the rest of the company so they can be the main assault and um, we're going to suppress the enemy, keep their head down so that the main body can go in and complete the objective. Ooh. Do you know how far you're moving? Roughly about 10k. Okay. Yeah. Happy? Happy. Let's shake out into order march. Uh, one minor change instead of patrolling in two teams, you could patrol in one, but with team one and then team two. Have you? Savage, let's go. Savage, Gallagher. So, uh, slow. Sir, call sign to you. Call sign to you. Roger. Just give us a calm sec, please, will you? So we've just arrived in a stop short. The platoon has stopped now and set up a, basically like a snap ambush. So there's some vehicles moving. There's some vehicles moving in around the area. I think the enemy and potentially could follow up. So they set up a snap ambush. They sort of counter that if that is the case. If not, sort of zero four. 05 in a minute, so we've probably got another hour to go until they move forward and punch on to their objective. But I don't know if you can see behind me, there's a bit of a high ground and they're going to use that as cover to wait here because obviously it's a desert and it's a really flat environment. And I want to minimise getting close so the enemy doesn't see them, so they can break in nice and sort of under the sort of cover of the sort of ground that they're using at the minute. So they'll, they'll wait for the last sort of five and ten minutes before that HR uh, to minimise the amount of time time crossing this sort of open terrain because as you can see the moon is really really bright and the sun's going to be coming up in about an hour's time so next time you'll see us we'll probably be in the FUP so that's the format point and then if not we'll bypass and we'll be straight into whenever they're assaulting on the objective itself
in the open, final attack heading, no fire towards or behind friendly. Attack time, push right. immediate. Hey, this left hand flank, just fixed, nothing else. Let's go. Hold that with a ranger. Move, 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 move! You leave him, this is what's going to happen. Go, stay. Take a fire team with you, gather them up and salt on Dharma. Yeah, Roger. How about you? Right. So Forbiton are currently sort of just about 20-30 metres away from the objective. They're currently pinned down now. They've made their way through the series of waters, taking a few enemy positions. But obviously the guys are wearing Tez sort of vests, which simulates casualties. And currently it stands, the platoon commander has become an injury, uh, has had an injury now, so he's now out of the fight. And it's one of the Sech commanders, so it's a corporal, corporal Leatham. Uh, he's now had to step up to platoon, to platoon commander. So it just shows you in this sort of aspect, everyone has to step up at some sort of time. So you do need to have your brains about you, you know, serving in the infantry, because you know, you're only one step away from stepping up and having to control the whole battle space itself. Oh, push your gun before we're under the cover! Get on today. It was a graft, not my usual, not my usual tack, all the infantry stuff, but I enjoyed it. I duck, I duck it on. Yeah, he did really good, gleaming. He just loves it. When everything was kicking off at about half four, five o'clock, he was just wagging his tail. Oh, yeah, he just wants to get involved, doesn't he? And then he got a bite, which is good. And then uh, is he hanging out now? Is he? Yeah, he's a bit tired now. So how long will he sleep for? Do you need to go up to the toilet or anything tonight? Do what? Well, you need to get up to go to the toilet. No, oh, I'll just tuck him out then. He, he's not done a shite yet, so... Does he wake you up in the middle of the night if he wants to go? Nah, he holds, he, it. he holds it, so I'll walk him off before I feed him. And then I'll walk him off before bed. Yeah. So, yeah, he gets enough time to, like, do his business and that. But yeah, he's, he's just knackered. What, what's your reflections on today? Uh, just... I was just trying to learn a lot from it, like, because I don't really get to do that sort of stuff often. Aye. Yeah, so I was really enjoying it. It was, yeah, it was hard, but it was good. So, a good experience for you today then? Yeah, I enjoyed it a and, lot. And a good run out with Doug? Yeah, he was smashed it. Jeez. Don't make him up. It's well away. How did you find it today? Yeah, it was alright, it was a good attack. Were yeah, you I hanging joke. out, were you? Sorry? Were you hanging out? Yeah, I was hanging out. Especially towards the end, the last the last couple of bounds towards that last position was. What's your reflections for today? My reflections for today: uh, eat well, sleep well, drink even better. <laughs> <laughs>